In a certain kingdom, in a certain land, there lived a blacksmith named Ivan. He was, um, poor? Lucky? No, brave. And he was looking for a... a wife. But on his way, he met a giant bear. Feed, chase off, attack. Yes, he bravely attacked the bear. They fought for three days and three nights. <laughs> Welcome to Streaming the Legs. My name is Mr. Orange, and this was the trailer for Yaga or Jaga. And yeah, that's a really funny uh, Eastern European uh, uh, folklore tale. Uh, indie game and uh, I definitely think it has it has some great art artwork very very nicely made as you can see here so the the main character or the main character is uh, some some shabby um shabby shabby lumberjack with a big red nose and he fights some very nasty uh enemies so uh, very very funny and I liked especially the fact uh the the last part of the trailer was funny. The pretty princess is turning into a monster. <laughs> All right, so great graphics, great uh, comic or uh, anime graphics. Well, well done. So release date is in 2019 and it's developed by Brad Grumps Interactive and published by Wars is Evil. And it's written on the Steam store page that it's an action RPG with a charming narrative that adapts to your choices set in the world of Slavic folklore. Play as Ivan, a one-handed blacksmith cursed with incredible black, uh, back, <laughs> not black luck, but bad luck. And the uh, features are building a reputation through role-playing results and different interaction with villagers and NPCs, unlocking secrets, trading options or be bestowing game-changing curses or blessings upon the player character. Pagan beliefs or pagan beliefs and superstitions are key to unlocking hidden secrets, getting house spirits on your side or avoiding the powerful curses of unclean creatures. Fateful crossroads between levels allow the player to influence the difficulty, challenge and level generation of the game. So level generation, okay, is it procedurally generated? That's, yeah, that's to find out. So discover and combine lots of talismans and, and artifacts that change the player's abilities and the gameplay. Craft and upgrade an arsenal of weapons and tools to aid you in your journey. Unique soundtrack featuring underground folklore band Subkarpachi. Okay, I hope I pronounced it correctly. So, very, very fun game. Very, very interesting. So, it looks like a game that you definitely, definitely play. Uh, play more maybe on a, on a casual, on a casual point of view, but you might have fun if you like well, indie games, uh, isometric uh, games pixel art games or games with nice uh, comic style so 
So definitely a game to look out for. So Nordic Game Discovery Contents, Game of the Year, Developer Play 2017 Best Visuals. Okay, very, very good. So my friends, I'm leaving my video here. Leave me a comment, a sub or a like if you enjoyed this video and I see you the next time.